Hi, buddy. Welcome to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Cebulski. The Penguins roll in as one of the hottest teams in hockey tonight, Ray. They haven't missed for a while. I've liked everything about them on this winning streak. They've took the game to their opponents. Their special teams have been good. Their goaltending's been good. When you're riding high, keep it rolling. Yeah, you can just feel the buzz in this city all day long, and we are seconds away now for this opening faceoff. The Islanders take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. New York's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Makes the save as he got a blocker on it. Quick feed to pull up. Nice pass. Gives them nothing in front. But he came out and challenged a good save. Can't catch up to the pass. New York's looking to break out. Pulak's carrying it ahead. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. And now he tries to get it across to Gensel. Pittsburgh's got the puck against the boards. Dismiss that chance. And now it's over to Latang. Hammers it on net, misses wide. Nobody's going to be able to block that unless they're way off target like his shot was. New York's got a hold of the puck. Sends the pass over. And now it's grabbed by Latang. Takes the feed. Really good long look pass to the forward. Answered the call there. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Way too much congestion blocks that. And the redirect goes awry. Denies him on the one-timer. After the game, walking your car in the rain, don't forget that we have a new parking area located beneath the stadium. Nearing the midway mark of the period. Still looking for our first goal. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. Here they are on the attack. Hammers the shot. Oh, what a stop. That is sweeping up the trash there. Good save. Off to the corner. Everybody can readjust. The Penguins get a hold of the puck along the boards. Couldn't find the intended target. And a great save. Nelson's the victim of a hook penalty coming up. Quick feed to Bovillia. Gets to the bench for the extra attacker. And the puck leaves the zone. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. Well, the official's going to give him two minutes to think about that one. Yeah, you can argue for a few seconds, James, I guess, but you already know at this point you're going to sit down. Our first opportunity to look at the power play unit set to go to work. This has been a stifling game. No goals yet, but now this power play has an opportunity to break through. Picked up along the boards by Nelson. Passes right to the front. Denies him in close. Gets it out of his own end. New York's looking to break out of their own end. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Unleashes a cannon. Denies him. He got all of it. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. The game is still scoreless. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. The Islanders have it against the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. The Islanders carry it along the wall. Strong defensive effort. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. He gets a piece of it with a stick. Nice zone entry from the right side. Sent into the far corner. Letty's moving the puck through his own zone. The Islanders take it across the line. Can't maintain possession. And that's just out of reach. Takes the feed. New York's got control. Of he scores! Put the special in special team. Now the coaches have been talking about a few new wrinkles on the power play. They moved the puck nicely, and the puck is in the back of the net on the power play. Power 
play's job is to create shots. And if you can create them from the most dangerous areas of the ice, you're going to be successful. Dead center, in the slot. He doesn't miss. New York's on the board. They lead it 1-0. I can't believe this game's going to end 1-0. So that first goal gives you a head start into what I hope is a pretty offensive game. Quick pass to Matheson. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Moves the puck. Receives the pass. Wide of the net. I like the shot. He didn't miss it by much, though. Past the halfway mark of this period. New York's up one zip. The Penguins win it. Taken by Pedersen. And that's stopped by Barlamov. Moves it to Boychuk. Moves the puck across to Clutterbuck. Back to the blue line. Turns him away. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it against the wall. Grabbed along the boards by Malkin. Stones him in front. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Here's a short pass to Clutterbuck. Pittsburgh's got the puck in their own end. And sends it just out of reach. And he takes a shot. I don't know where that was going. Oh, James, that was so wide. You see the look on his face? He can't believe he missed the net by that much. Oh, he almost put him through the boards. Takes it into the slot. Pittsburgh's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Reads the pass perfectly and picks it off. Here's an odd man rush. Lads hauled down. Penalty on the way. Big save. And there's the whistle. Let's hear the official call. Ruido's called for tripping. He's off to the box. As soon as the hands go up when they start to plead with the ref, you know they know they're guilty. The Islanders send their man advantage unit out once more. As someone who played a lot on the power play, you get one early in a game, it gives you more confidence. They look like they're ready to get another one. And that's blocked. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. Gets it out of his own end. Pulak's taking it from his own end. Gains the zone from the right side. Here's a shot. Locks it down with a stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. Barzell's dangerous, and he's got the puck now. He had the go-ahead goal earlier on. Cutting to the front of the net. He scores! Putting the special in special teams tonight. Uh, the extra work they've done, the way that they've moved some people around, has helped them cash in more than once on the power play. Killers just ran out of gas here. They're under incredible pressure from the power play. Eventually, it's a power play goal as they capitalize on the extra man. Late goings of this period. The Islanders have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. The Penguins win the faceoff. Moves it quickly over to Crosby. Less than a minute to go here in the opening frame. Great pad save. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up, spreads out, and makes the save. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. Trying to get back on the attack now. Just wide. And there's the horn to end the period. They threw everything but the kitchen sink but they've run out of time. Willemans Recycling is a proud sponsor of tonight's game. Willemans Recycling... Both teams heading down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. more about their services, check out the website.
Second period set to get underway. The Penguins win the draw here in the neutral zone. Fails to find the open man. With the steal. Here's a shot. Great stop by Varlamov. And now he angles it across to Kapanen. Lays out to get in front of that one. Picks off the pass. Tried to make a move and the puck hops away. Feeds it down low. Into the corner, he takes the pass. New York's got the puck. Angles it over to Barzell. That pass doesn't go. Sends a pass over. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Too much traffic in the lane. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Jostling for the puck, and it's knocked away. And now he moves it to Zucker. Puts it to the front of the net, and he scores! What a shot! His work rate off the puck here is what got him the spot to shoot from. He found the spot, was able to set up, and then takes no time to put it away. The Penguins are back to center ice, and they have narrowed that gap. Cut the lead in half. The comeback's on. Now they must push forward, see if they can get the equalizer. Moves it on over to Nelson. Couldn't complete the play. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. Grabs it in his own end. They've got the defense outnumbered. Unloads a shot and puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. No, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. Slides it across to Pedersen. There's the whistle. Offside is the call, stopping the play. Russ certainly in a confident state here. His point streak's extending, and he wants to keep it going. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The Penguins make their way back into the face-off circle, still in search of another goal. He grabs the puck here at the point, and he comes up with it. Through center along the wing. Here's a chance, a two-on-one, and he makes the save. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. The Islanders have it against the wall. New York's got it in their own zone. Obstruction penalty coming up. Looks like a hook here. And there's the whistle stopping the play. This is a good old-fashioned hooking the call here. He looked like he was water skiing. Man, you got to move your feet. You get your stick around his waist, you'll get called. Time for the power play unit to get back to work. They've already scored on the power play tonight. They'll get another chance here. James, I don't think they have to change anything with the way they go about it. And that's broken up with a stick in front. The Penguins going to work on offense. Makes the save! The Islanders move the puck in the defensive zone. And it's a quick pass to Nelson. New York's moving it into the offensive end. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. New York's got the puck along the boards. Tries to get it out of their own end. And that one's blocked. Man, shoot it off the glass. Get it out of there. New York's gained possession along the boards with the stop. I love these second looks at this. You see the player transfer his weight, hammer this slapper, but the goalie makes a save. The Penguins have had a lot of good looks offensively, but they still trail in the second. Pittsburgh's won the draw. Here's a chance to clear the defensive zone. And clearing attempt is a big success on that play. Quick feed to Nelson. And the puck is moved to a safer spot on the ice. Here's a chance. Stopped by the goaltender. Handles the puck. A little rock him, suck him on the play. Centering pass. And that's broken up. And a successful clearing attempt. Tries to make that cross ice feed. And the puck departs the zone. Pittsburgh's got possession at center. From along the wall, takes a shot, stops him cold. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. And loses possession after a solid hit. Quick pass to Kapanen. 
Puck dumped in and the forwards go for a change. The Islanders take over on possession. The Penguins are back to even strength here. Too passive, not aggressive enough. The puck gets moved around the outside of the penalty killers, really doesn't become a dangerous power play. New York's got control of it now from their own end. Passes on over to Lee. The Islanders played along the boards. Snapper from the slot, there it is, he scores! All over the rebound, and he taps it in! Bang, bang, shot off the goalie. The puck falls down and the shooter's the one that gets to the rebound, and he puts it in. The Islanders make their way back to set a race here with now a two-goal lead in the second. Nice to pad the one-goal lead. They've played well, and now they've earned this spot in the game. Wrist shot from the slot, denies it in front. Yeah, he's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. Takes a shot, lays out with a block. Now can he get up? Oh, they've got numbers to his teammate. Denies him with a save. Matheson's gonna play it near the point. Big stop by the keeper. Varlamov's been sharp stopping the puck tonight. He's got a really good save percentage, and his team's done a good job at the offensive zone as well. Well, this crowd is into it, and I'll tell you what, this has been an ongoing story for a while now with the attendance. It is, James. It doesn't just happen, though. The marketing people do their job. They get people interested in it. The guys on the ice do their job. Now people come and have fun, and you look around, and there's not a seat anywhere. Huge hit! Whoa, he got rattled hard. Not only that, he dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself and go pick up his twig as well. Can't find his man. From the place 99 made famous. They score! The Penguins are soaring tonight! When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. The Penguins get a much-needed goal here late in the second, Razor. Put themselves within striking distance. You want to give yourself a chance. They've done that. New York's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Clutterbuck stick handling in his own zone. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Pokes it away in his own end. They get it out of the defensive end. Takes the pass. The Penguins get a hold of it. Chaps the puck away. Centering pass! And that one's broken off. Great block there. Moves it to Sezikis. And that pass goes awry. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. The Penguins seem almost a little frustrated out there as we near the end of the second period. They've had plenty of chances, just cannot convert. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Here's a short pass to Ladd. Takes the feed, and he loses control of the puck. Takes it across the blue line. Here's an opportunity to get the puck out of their own end. And that should do it, 20 more minutes in the books. And there's the horn ending, period number two. Boy, no shortage of offense here. Are you ready for a walk down memory lane? Then it's time to sign up for our fantasy game. Play hockey with childhood heroes. It's a fun Call us for details, or you can visit the team website. Third period is just around the corner, so don't even think about putting that controller down. James Sabolski, and we are ready to get this third period going. Here we go. Put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period. We are underway. Once again, I'll send it back down to my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, who is at ringside. Ray, we've got two periods played. 
How do you see this thing? The Penguins continue to trail, but the good news is it's only by one. Also, the good news is they've had the puck a lot tonight. Maybe they can find the tying goal. And momentum on their side as they win the buries it for the goal. I always wanted to have a fast start. It's funny, you go no goals in three games in the middle of the year, nobody cares. At the start, it really matters. The defensive team can't get control of the puck off this faceoff. It ends up into the shooter's hands, and he beats the goaltender. Lots of time left in this period. It's all tied up. The Penguins win possession here in the open ice. And that one flies over the net. Scooped up along the wall by Gensel. Puck picked up by Crosby. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Good hit on the play. Puck grabbed by Kulak. Pass across to Marcel. Pittsburgh's looking to break out of their own end. And he regains control of the puck. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Kapanen. Couldn't catch up to that pass. New York's got it in their own zone. Stopped by the goaltender. And now he tries to get it across to Dumoulin. Again, the denial by the goaltender. After the first stop, he's in good position to make a second. Even though that puck is delivered with great velocity, that looked like a pretty easy stop for the goalie to make. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Islanders get a hold of the puck in their own end. Nice puck check inside the attacking zone. And not much on that one. Puck scooped up by Letty. Pucks it away to stay on the attack. Gets it over to Lee. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Denies him on the slapper. Taken along the wall by Beauvillier. From the boards, he takes that pass. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Good defensive stop with the poke check. The Islanders have it from their own end. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Nice poke check. Moves it quickly over to Tanev. Can't get a hold of that pass. Knocked away. The Penguins take it along the wall. Just puts it over the net. Not by much, that's a quick release. He's going for all the money and he just misses. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Directed over to Clutterbuck. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Tries to feed it across. Oh, set that hit up perfectly. Tanev's got control of the puck in the corner. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. New York's across the blue line. The Penguins gain possession in their own end. New York's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Stick save! Oh, you're not going to get a better chance than that, but the goalkeeper does a great job. And now it's over to McCann. And that one's stolen at center ice. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And now he angles it across to Pacho. Lays out to block it. Scores! Well, I like when the bottle goes up in the air, how angry the goalie gets, like he slaps the bottle away. It's not the bottle's fault, like stop the puck, man. Just the insult to injury with the bottle pop. Goaltender's playing the percentages here, James. He drops into the butterfly, but he leaves the top of the net open, gets beat up over the stick side. New York's close to the finish line, and they've got the one goal lead. Keep pushing. You've got the lead, but don't let it slip away by trying to be too conservative. And now it's grabbed by Dumoulin, and couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Quick shot denied by the goaltender. Taken by Latang. Slides the puck across to Jankowski. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. The team would like to thank you for your continued overwhelming support. Past the midway mark of the frame, New York's got a one-goal lead. 
Pachos won the draw. The Islanders move it in. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Tosses it to Latang. And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll have to regroup and makes the save. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. New York's moving the puck through center ice. The Penguins look to start the transition game. Pittsburgh's got the puck in the defensive end. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play... Continues. Pass back to the point. Pittsburgh's emptied the net. The extra attacker's now out on the ice. Smart towards the gaping net. Puck picked up by Crosby. Final minute to go here in the third. And that's blocked. Aaron pass and the play's broken up. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. Works it across to Bailey. The Islanders have it now. Here they come. Quick feed to Letty. Can't connect. Grabs control of it at the point. Takes a shot. And the puck dies with the trapper save. All right, time out at ice level. You're the coach. What are you doing here? First thing I do is make sure I've got the right guys on the ice, and then I diagram a play so that everybody knows where they're supposed to be. Getting into the later stages of this period, New York's got a one-goal lead here. They're up 4-3. Right on the doorstep. Puck grab by Lee. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Lee's lugging the puck. Nice pass. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Lee's wide open net and comes up empty. That's all she wrote from this one. New York's effort finally enough to put them over the top and back in the win column. Finally, this losing streak goes in the rearview mirror, James. It's been such a long time for them that they've been able to taste the winner's spoil. Hooray, Ferraro! My name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us, everybody. Have a great night.